Low carbon, climate resilient infrastructure is critical to delivering sustainable economic growth and climate action. Across emerging markets and developing economies, public budgets alone are insufficient to fund the enormous infrastructure needs, creating an investment gap of 3.3 trillion US dollars every year. Private capital plays a critical role in closing this gap. Established in 2014 as an initiative of the G20 and the World Bank, the Global Infrastructure Facility, or the GIF, was created to stimulate private sector investment in developing country infrastructure. Through its network of multilateral development banks, the GIF provides comprehensive transaction advisory services to governments at all levels, generating bankable, sustainable, and quality infrastructure pipelines. It's the organizations like GIF uh, that can step in building capacity and helping them develop the pipeline and, and selecting pilot projects so that in a matter of five to ten years, the government can start implementing projects with private sector participation. The GIF's advisory partners represent more than 13 trillion U.S. dollars in assets under management and help maximize the commercial viability of GIF-supported programs and projects. It is a, a challenge to bring available capital to these projects. GIF brings together um, many different uh, individuals and perspectives to bring more financeable solutions. In less than five years, the GIF has supported 77 infrastructure programs and projects across 40 developing countries, over two-thirds of which are climate smart. These activities are expected to mobilize 67 billion U.S. dollars in total investment, including 44 billion from the private sector. More than a quarter of these projects target city infrastructure. Cities consume close to two-thirds of the world's energy, generate more than 70% of greenhouse gas emissions, and are increasingly vulnerable to the effects of climate change. This is why the GIF is expanding its portfolio of low-carbon, climate-resilient urban infrastructure, creating bankable opportunities for private investment. Projects like bus rapid transit in Senegal, a street lighting program in Brazil expected to be scaled to more than 200 municipalities in subsequent phases, and waste-to-energy facilities in Indonesia. Out of the 12 cities, there are seven uh, PPP schemes now being developed. And with GIF support in Bandung, there are significant opportunities for the other cities for the development of waste energy projects. With 70% of the world's population expected to live in cities by 2050, it's more critical than ever to rethink how we finance urban development and climate smart infrastructure. And with deeper integration of cities in the GIF strategic orientation, the Global Infrastructure Facility is doing its part to build sustainable and quality urban infrastructure around the world.